So, we woke up the next morning having to leave a friend's house with the happiest dog ever. I mean, his dog, his name was Charlie. He was a pointer who actually points. And he was just such a nice and happy dog. But now it's time to get back on the road. So, driving through Dallas, very city-like. It's nothing like Hawaii. Hawaii has, like, no city at all. But then we had to. Stopped at another local Walmart, and there's some rollbacks, not as good as the last one, but still good clearance, and I like these little displays over here. These ones are pretty, not as good, but these ones are pretty good over here. Displays are okay, I mean, they're not the best displays, but there are some rollbacks. Not gonna get anything, since I just spent money getting my thing from the Lego store the other day. But it's worth noting that these Walmarts on the mainland have a lot more clearance than in Hawaii. A lot more. And back on the road we go. So, we drove through Texas, which took a lot longer, but, you know, Texas is a big state, and most people say that it takes forever to drive through Texas. The drive was pretty boring. It did rain a little bit on us, because it was pretty rainy. Uh, during our stay in Texas, and it was still raining, but then we entered the state of Louisiana. gonna spend the night in Louisiana since it wasn't really it was a quick state to get through so we just drove through Louisiana pretty quickly and um, eventually ended up in Mississippi <laughs> Mississippi was gorgeous and the trees were just stunning but then once again Walmart is very stuck but just not as much rollback at all. I don't see anything new as I'm, I am looking for stuff new. But yeah, they're very well stocked, just not uh, any actual good deals, really, in my opinion. The next morning, we got up bright and early and just started driving once again. Saw some cows again. We saw a lot of cows and made our way into Alabama. And then we saw this huge battleship that was probably retired, a retired battleship, but then we hit Florida. Florida welcomes you, and I'm so excited to be here. We finally made it after days of driving. We are finally in Florida. So bring it on. We have lots to do, and I still be vlogging after this. Now let's go check out that visitor center. house for the next week or two while they're gone are actually house sitting with the dogs. The dogs will be in the next vlog, I promise you. They're sleeping right now and I need to finish editing this. But we I went to the pickle brick wall at the Lego store in Dallas, which felt like forever ago and I forgot my camera. It would have been in the vlog but I forgot my camera. But I did get a little tiny haul of pick a pick a brick cup, the big one. And I haven't been to a pick a brick wall in three years because 
one in Hawaii. I don't go to very often. It's really close, but the mall is just terrible. And they've been closed. They haven't opened the pickup brick wall in since COVID, pretty much it. So I haven't been to a pickup brick wall in ages, and they had really great pieces. So here are the pieces I get. I got one by six sand green, one by two white tiles, which I'm very excited about. Those two will become together to make some kind of building, probably. Some corner rounds in dark red, just because. Some one by one brackets, which are very useful pieces that I don't have very many of, so I was happy to get some in such a good color. Some one by one like slope tile piece. I think this piece is very useful in many different ways. And I'm excited to see different ways I can use it. Some 2x2 two two sand jumper plates, which are just always good to have. Some 2x2 two two round brown tiles. 1x2 uh, slope kind of pieces. They're the slope tiles, kind of. And then the quarter rounds of the brick kite. And I put all of those pieces together. Minus the brown tiles to create this little thing. I don't know what it really is, but I think it looks pretty cool. I don't know, maybe I'll hang it somewhere. Probably not. I'll probably take it apart because I used a lot of bricks on it, but I still like it nonetheless. Next couple days, we're just going to be resting. There is a Lego store very close by. It's like in 15 minutes away, so we'll probably be going to that one. There's a Walmart, Target, of course, we'll have to go there eventually. Dollar store, which I'm excited to go to. I haven't been to a dollar store in two years, so. There, are, there aren't any in Hawaii, so I'm very excited to go there. And much more will be coming up in the next vlog, and we'll see you next time on Debrick Show. Remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned.